a four-time winner on the European Tour, Bernd Wiesberger is already the most successful Austrian golfer of all time. A former Challenge Tour standout, the 31-year-old is now ranked in the top 30 in the world and firmly established as one of the stars of European golf. We caught up with him at the Lioness Open just outside Vienna, a tournament that gives him a rare opportunity to play in front of his home fans. Well, in a way, I'm glad I only get to play one week because that means I've done well and, and uh, be able to travel the world and play European Tour Golf um, all over the globe. And um, obviously, uh, the World Golf events and the major championships. Um, but in the same sense, it kind of makes it even more special to, to be here in front of the home crowd. It's, um, it's a special week and one I'm looking forward to very early, uh, basically the Monday after the, uh, the previous year to, to go out and play again. The tournament has proved a fruitful one for Wiesberger, who's finished in the top five three times since 2011. That includes memorably claiming his second European Tour title here back in 2012. Definitely, it was a special week, it was a special day. Um, very emotional, few uh, few holes there, the last, last 10. Uh, I wasn't really in position to, uh, to win. Um, with probably 10 holes left. It was a very important shot on, on this hole, which was uh, number nine then, now it's 18, uh, for the way to, to set it up um, as, an, as, a, as a stadium atmosphere in the last. Well, this is up the hill, left to right. That's all right for pace. Unbelievable. Wiesberger certainly finished things off in style, holding a 50-foot putt for birdie on the last to cap off a stunning win on home soil. It was great to be able to pull off uh, such a day and such a, such a finish to a, to, to a week. Uh, it, was, uh, it was something special and, and you know, probably the, the shot that will stay with me for, for a long time. Since playing in the Olympics last August, Bernd has been in fantastic form, posting seven top five finishes on the European Tour, including firing an unprecedented nine birdies in a row at this year's Malaysian Open. The only thing missing was a win. I had a few good finishes. I, I was close at the KLM where um, obviously Joost had, uh, I don't know what he did to his putter, to be honest, but um, it must have been something uh, very special. Played really well at British Masters, was close there where, where Alex had a, had a great win. Um, so I knew if I was doing that stuff and, and keep on plugging away, I would uh, sooner or later have, have uh, my time coming for me as well. And it was, it was worth the wait. That win came in April at the Shenzhen International in China. Facing off against Tommy Fleetwood in a sudden death playoff, Bernd played one of the shots of his career to secure his fourth European Tour title. Well, given the circumstances, definitely, I mean, uh, guys, guys voted for it for the shot of the month. Um, and um, that, was, that was nice, you know, obviously, at the end of that week, it, it was the shot that won me the tournament in, in that playoff, going head to head with Tommy, who had a great day. And um, uh, it was special, you know, I, uh, I don't remember much of it. I, I, I just remember it was a nine iron and um, I ended up where it did. So uh, just as, as the one, in, in Austria, uh, a shot, you know, if, you, if, you, if you're able to pull one of these off in, in uh, situations uh, like that, it's very close in, in your association with, with that week and that, that win. It also finally gave Wiesberger a victory in a playoff at the fourth time of asking. I've been in one five-man playoff in my first one in, uh, uh, up in Glen Eagle, so... Um, that was quite strange being with five other guys on the, on the tee box. Um, three man playoff back in, in, in Ireland with where, where Soren won. Uh, once got beaten on this screen right behind me as well, uh, to a freak putt. But uh, you know, it's, that's the, the things that come in a career as well, and, and therefore um, just a matter of time that you know, I'm on the, on the end where I, I'm able to pull off a shot just as I did in, in Shenzhen at the right moment. And uh, uh, I'm glad I, uh, I won one of the four playoffs I've played so far now. The next goal for Wiesberger is to improve on his performances at the majors, in which he's yet to post a top 10 finish in 16 appearances. 
However, a share of 16th place at the US Open suggests he has the pedigree to challenge at the game's biggest events. I've always got my little things that I need to improve for my game itself. But, um, you know, I'm in a position where I'm able to play all the events and I'm trying to you know, prepare as, as good as I can for, for those, um, those big events, maybe the Rolex Series or World Golf events and majors. And uh, I'm just trying to um, I feel like I, uh, I want to perform a little bit better in those and um, played really well at the, the Players' Championship uh, over there, uh, finishing in 12th. So that it kind of shows me I'm, I'm up for it and getting closer to the leaderboards on, on Sunday afternoon again. And, um, you know, that's, that's, uh, that's a goal and a target for myself to, to make that happen a little bit more often in, uh, in the really big events.